ILCP. Step six. You've made it. So here in step six, you've come to the point where you are going to now complete your assessment that you already outlined. It may actually not even be the same assessment. You might have changed it, which is okay. Um, but one of the main goals of your assessment is that you need to meet your objectives. Look at your objectives that you wrote, your I can objectives, and make sure your assessment covers all those objectives. Okay, that's a, that's a main goal of this step six. Uh, hopefully the um, assessment that you designed is something that you're going to have fun doing, that it's creative. When you think you're finished, um, read through or look over or watch your assessment and make sure, double check that it met all of the objectives that you set out for yourself. It might be a good idea to have somebody else check your assessment good and idea. your objectives to make sure that your objectives were met. That is a great idea. It's an objective way to check your objectives. <laughs> <laughs> Our experiences. Um, so when I was making my video, uh, I kind of was stuck on what I was going to do and what helped me is I knew I, I was kind of experienced making videos so I thought that would be a good route. Um, I didn't know how I was going to show my objectives, if I was going to use like a different person boxing or me. Um, but what I found helpful was looking through my apps on my iPad and even though I don't know how to use some of them I thought I could potentially use them so I kind of uh, ex explored them and saw what they can do and I wound up using one of the apps on the iPad um, to draw things and to um, write on the video which was very helpful so um, I guess my advice to you is look at the things you have on your iPad and even though you might not know how to use some of those um, apps, uh, just try it out because um, you may like it. For my assessment, um, as you guys know, it changed a couple times, um, but I was happy with the one that I ended up doing. So I ended up doing um, journal entries and what I liked about it was it was kind of a creative way to show that I learned all that information about the Mars One program. Um, and it actually went back to how I picked my topic too because the um, book that I read, The Martian, was a journal of somebody who was um, living on Mars. And so it was similar, but then I had to use the new information that I learned. Um, so it was a good creative way to show that um, I learned that stuff. When I was completing my assessment, um, I kept in mind what would I want to know if I threw up and so that really helped me um, but it also made me realize that I needed to do a little more research even though all of my research had met my objectives um, there was just a couple more things I wanted to know and that was fine I just used a couple more sources to get the information that I wanted so it was good if you want to see our final projects you can check them out on Schoology fun.